Hola, it's Gabby here from Casting Gabby. And right now I'm showing a kit that um, just arrived. Uh, it's new for me and it's from Queen and Company. Uh, I ordered the fruit basket kit and the candlelight kit. Kit. Right now I'm showing what is in the candlelight kit. That is the uh, paper pack, uh, seven die cuts, uh, the set of stamps, some uh, I think it's synthetic wood, uh, wool, um, wool. I really don't know if it's synthetic or not, but the colors are very nice. They also have all the foam double side for the shakers and the shakers elements uh, these are very beautiful the paper is awesome and the colors are very nice very intense uh, colors and they have a lot of uh, stuff oh they even have the acetate for covering the shakers and I show the thank you that they sent for the order they the package are very uh, well uh, present. They they show in this that they care about the customers. Uh, right now, I'm showing the fruit basket kit. They come with uh, the same um, well, the same no uh, about the um, the same contents that the other kit with the paper pack, but with the, with fruits uh, fruits made in uh, clay I think female clay uh, they are super super cute and the colors also are amazing the intents of the paper the the pattern uh, papers are very cute and the stamp set is awesome it comes with one two three four five six six uh, die cuts oh uh, well, I'm right now using the apple from the fruit basket kit to make uh, my first card and using this apple to open um, into um, I, I forget all the words suddenly to cut this in two card stocks in white uh, now I'm going to cover the apple with the acetate and I'm going to color the acetate with my window paint uh, in red, brown, and green. After I finish coloring, I just set the car uh, to dry. But here is another car that I made before, and I use the same uh, method that I use in the car that I show in the camera. I glued an acetate in the back of the car, and I'm going to glue also the uh, car stock that I cut with uh, together, because as you remember, I cut two um, at the same time. After I glue this, I'm going to stamp a fairy and I'm going to color with the copy markers and glue it to the car and add some details with my um, white gel pen. I'm showing right now the, the car is uh, see-through 
and it shine shine with the light. I was thinking that it would be good if we can hide in the back of the car a um, TV light. I think that's the name of the lights. I'm going to try that um, soon. We'll see. Um, as you see here, I'm adding to the details to the fairy. And I also going to stamp uh, the sentiment that is say uh, you are awesome all the way to the core. And I'm going to add in the inside of the car behind the apple a little mouse uh, that I color previously with my copy markers also. And I'm going to add it in the window and, and you will see um, through the apple. You will see the mouse through the apple. As you see here, I made my car paste that is five and a half by four and three quarters, but it did the fall in four and one quarter to have the A2 car, and I do glue glue the um, and I glue my panel to that to keep the the window uh, see through in the car. Now I'm going to start my second card. Um, I'm going to use the orange die cut, and I'm going to use the same technique. I'm going to uh, uh, I cut a um, circle in acetate, and I'm going to add to this circle um, yellow, or dark yellow um, color, the same uh, glass uh, window coloring, and I'm going to wait for this to dry. Um, as you see here, it's very like chunky and sticky, but when you let it dry, it's going to flood a little bit more. I prepared my car um, panel and grab a uh, slice of orange that is from Paper Smooshes. This uh, and then stamping in orange, and I'm also going to stamp some uh, details in dark green. Okay, I finished my car pattern and I cut a circle uh, with the scallops and I also cut the center of the orange and I painted with the copy markers in very very light yellowish green and I'm going to glue everything um, together. Uh, first I glue the uh, scallop circle and then I glue the the front of the orange in the acetate and then I glue the whole thing to the to the car. As you see here I add in the sentiment in the a piece of a uh, vellum and I'm going to use my white embossing powder.
to glue the, the um, balloon sentiment, I'm going to use my sticker maker. And I press it uh, with my bone folder and go around to um, be uh, sure that this the sticky part stay inside the petal. I fold it in the back, I press it very well. This is a very um, thick vellum and now we're going to glue it to my um, car base and now I'm going to add to the uh, slices of orange a little bit of um, uh, shadows with my um, white cup sorry my white gel pen now I'm going to start my third card uh, this is going to be again with the apple the apple that I did in camera I just try and I glue it with the with the paper in the back I didn't put acetate in the back of this apple because I wasn't trying to experience with um, glossy accents I didn't work as you see it's the white and now I'm going to use the card like this I glue a piece of white in the back for the the, the, the squares the little squares don't um, see through the apple and I'm going to cut this a little bit smaller than the um, A2 card size is and after that I'm going to stamp the sentiment in black embossing powder but um, in a vellum also but it get lost in the pattern paper and I decided to glue it in a piece of white cardstock I also going to add um, Heart. I was remember. Well, I don't remember how they call right now. But I'm going to add a heart to this brat. Yes, I'm going to add a heart brat to this, and I'm going to glue it everything with foam tape. After every, everything is glued down to my card uh, base, I'm going to add some details with uh, little jewels in red, green, and clear. The clear I just added in the app, and as you see here, is the other two cards. And here are the three cards that I made uh, for this video. But after you see these images, for that, are you still talking and not say goodbye yet? I went crazy with the acetate and the paint. I want to make something called like a galaxy looking things. And it worked uh, a little bit, uh, but it, 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 you have to wait too long to, to dry. I went crazy with the paint, but when I glued the, the acetate in the top, and then squish it, squish it to get the look that I want. I add a little bit more paint. And they look good, but like I say, you have to wait like 
three to four days for them to dry. Maybe I would do a, a, a video using this uh, Galaxy scene and see how they look. Well, thank you for watching my videos. Until next time, goodbye. Thank you.